Hey folks, welcome back to the Indie Buffet. Today we're checking out Moonlighter to grab yourself a plate. This is a game that I haven't got a chance to play a ton of. As you see, I already have a, a save file, but what we're gonna do, we're gonna kinda go for the new game. We're gonna erase this one and be like, no, 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 no. We're starting all over for the audience. We're starting all over, let's do that. Got a new game, no new game plus. New game plus is when you beat the game. So this is kind of one of those things where it's like, Recommended for most players. Oh, original difficulty is hard. Huh. Okay, let's do hard. I did, I've did. i never seen a game where, I mean, maybe a Dark Souls game, maybe a game that likes pain, but I've never seen a game where it's like, oh, hard is our original difficulty. <laughs> Among the stars of the night, there is a land of old imagination. Ooh. One night, mazes full of extraordinary treasures and deadly creatures appeared in this land. They called them the dungeons. Strange, ever-changing ruins of unknown lands love they call them just the dungeons soon a village of a slightly curious took root near the dungeons this they named rhinoka among the settlers two groups shine bright as heroes and merchants glory and riches but the dungeons proved too dangerous they were soon closed as many lives were lost in their depths life became hard for the town especially for the young owner of the oldest shop will of moonlighter Long dreaming of opening the mysterious fifth door to the dungeons. He pits on his bandana of truth. Yeah, I've always thought about coming into this game and checking it out again. I haven't had a chance to really sit down and play this game. Uh, it, it's kind of a, a super cool little roguelite that you kind of have the Zelda combat here, like this little action combat. And you also have a, like a shop sim almost. Because after this, you actually get a shop. You inherit a shop. And you start selling things that you find in the dungeon. Which I thought, I've always thought was super cool. That they had this originality to... Oh, oh, I thought he was going to attack us. I swear. Do, 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 do. Oh. Oh, he said ninja. Oh. Oh, A attacks. Oh, he's got like a broom. Aha. Cleaning up justice. What is the right trigger do? Oh, it takes a potion. Okay, cool. Hey. Sweeping up justice. One broom swing at a time. I don't know what that thing is, but it's cute. Oh, the last fell off. That's that's awesome. Let's go see what we got here. Oh, the tutorial's trying to teach me. Hey, by the way. Oh, wait, maybe I want to take this stuff. Yeah, let's take this. Quick move all. There we go. Get this. Check what's in here. What says a broken sword? Yeah, let's just take, let's just take it all. We're taking everything. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh, oh no. Okay, so this is obviously the time when I think I'm supposed to I think I'm supposed to die in this room, if I'm not mistaken. Okay, yeah, that, that that's that's the room you uh that's the room you're supposed to fall in. I honestly think there's no way I'd be in that room. And if you beat that room, I'd love to see the footage. I mean, you know, beat the room with in the beginning, not beat the room like later on. No, like beat the room now. Xenon, warrior princess, ha ha. Oh, no, no, man, that's Xena. <laughs> Oops, what a sorry looking kid. All alone now, rest for a bit, Will. I have you now. His beard is epic, though. Was Zeta's beard epic? I'm just kidding. Actually, Lucy Lawless is one of my, used to be one of my favorite actresses. I used to, I used to love Lucy Lawless. I used to love Xena and that Hercules. Remember that Xena, that Hercules, like that late night, the late night little dish that used to be so much fun to watch. You used to just sit there. 
I can't do it. Is that, how, is that how she used to do it? She used to do something like that, right? She used to do some type of, like, yellow. And Hercules, it's so funny because Kevin Sorbo did never look like he was gigantic. He never looked like he was huge. But he played Hercules, and he lifted huge rocks. <laughs> Even as a mere child, barely able to walk, you were curious for the dungeons. Oh, yeah, look at that. There's no doubt you carry the same obsession as old Pete. Old Pete. Yeah, well, Pete... Pete was a weakling. I'm I'm a strong boy. Money boy, did our little merchant bite off more than he can manage? I mean, maybe. Well, listen to me. The hard truth is this. You are the last of your family, the only one left to run Moonlighter. You can't keep pushing yourself like this. Risking your life on this fifth door nonsense is just foolish. Leave it. Find some artifacts and use your penance. Get out of the dungeon. And for creator's sake, stop using that broom of yours, you daft boy. It's dangerous. Go alone. Take this. Oh, they use the line. They use the, the line. That was the line. It's mine from back in the day. Use it. I have a little need for it now. Oh, look, he's got a sword and shield just randomly in his pocket. That's why I keep my sword and shield. Right next to my wallet. <laughs> now then, get up. You're wasting light. You have. I can't have you neglect the shop all day. Let's see if I can get you through your hard, uh, your hard head. Some of that tricks that I picked up from your grandfather so many, many years ago. I know that Sword and Shield is like, the Sword and Shield is the usual, but I wouldn't mind checking out that, um, that staff that he's got on there. I kind of like staff. Since we selling your merchandise takes knowledge of two things. You must know an alley item's value as well as its demand. Come now, open the shop up and all the customers come in. Okay. Yo, that's expensive. Hold to open shop. Coming in. Hello. Oh. Yeah, sure. Is that one good for you? Yeah? D D D Yeah, what do you think? What do you think? Pretty good? Yeah, you're happy? Okay, cool. We got a sale. We got a sale. You see that? Best expression you can hope for. The item wasn't too expensive for them and not so cheap for you to lose profit. Be sure to pay attention to your customer's expressions. That's how your grandfather always know if they fair price his prices were fair. Well, I kinda want this. Not oh, not no. I don't think I need to tell you how that item is obviously overpriced. Lesson learned? Yeah. Finally, be careful of selling a, proper, a popular item too much. If you flood the market, you will have to offer cheap prices on your wares. Point is, charge higher when something is in high demand and in low supply. Take out your merchant notebook. It should hold all the information you've gathered on discovered wares and artifacts. I still have a broom. <laughs> I still have a broom. Oh, look at all that. Okay. Would seem the sun has fallen for the day. I best head off. You pick up more on your own. Restoring the shot to its full glory, that responsibility falls on you, not I. It's in your blood, will Make us proud. In the meantime, why don't you try out that new sword of yours? Dungeons are more perilous than I, but one can always find better artifacts. Just don't dive that far. And use that pendant, boy. I always like the old men always call the guys boys. He's like, boy. He's like, I'm 45. Yeah, boy. Uh, go on now. These weary bones of mine must rest. Okay. Gotta go. Ooh. Did I test on the guard? People were never going to test them to culture artifacts from the dungeons. They have become a part of our daily lives. Even a part of our food. So what, you grind up these metal artifacts or these wooden artifacts and you're just like, yeah, I'm just gonna, gonna stick it on my omelet. <laughs> I guess it's each their own. I mean, who am I to judge if you like a metal omelet? Cannot, I was gonna say, cannot break boxes, but there we go. Can I break metal boxes for obvious reasons? The Golem Dungeon dungeon available at Merchant of Heroes. Oh, that's not the Golem Dungeon. Forest Dungeon, dungeon available to heroes, not recommended for merchants. Oh. So what do I count? Because I feel like I'm both. Tech Dungeon, no entry. Oh. Desert Dungeon, only for heroes. What's this big one? Is that the fifth floor? That's the fifth floor. 
All right, this is the only one that opened when I touched it, so let's go see what we can do. Ooh, that dripping sound got me. I actually thought it was like in my house. I don't know if I like this A as my swing. I usually, for some reason, like B as, or X as swing. I'm not sure how weird that is, but that, that's kind of like how I like things. I might change my key binding. Yeah, I might do Let's do that right now. Let's go and change our key binding because I... Oh, yeah, don't... Do that, by the way. Controls. Move up, down, left, right. Oh, main attack, A. Pendant shortcut, B. Secondary attack, X. Oh, well, let's, let's put our main attack is X and our secondary attack is A. What do you mean my shield? Does that mean I could carry... Yep. I mean, they can carry the broom. Uh-oh. It's all about running. It's all about, oh, oh. It's all about making, I mean, not running. It's all about making sure you stay at a distance. Running. It's all about running. Oh, no. I'm doing consistent 25 damage. Oh, yeah? Collect those things real fast. My inventory is filling really quickly. Uh-oh. That thing's gonna jump up, isn't it? That thing's gonna jump up. We know it's gonna jump up. We know, right? Right? We know it's gonna jump up, right? Read. Oh, maybe that's why they have it as an attack. Okay, one sec. Yep, the person I hopefully have far better than luck than I have made time is short. I took a drink from the strange creature across the room, my pennant, all but shattered from the shuffle. Check him out, though. I'd say I fared better than him. He caught me spying on him near the guardian's room. He dropped a couple items when he fled. One of them, which is my di map diagram. Whatever it is, I was right. They called me crazy. They say, oh, it was crazy P, done, gone, lost his marbles. But I was right. Each guardian of the dungeon must possess a key of sorts. All of them linked the giant locked door outside the dungeons, the fifth door of Rhinoka. Sadly, I won't be around to see the door open. To whoever found me, I apologize for the smell, but the diagram should be here around here somewhere. Please, open the fifth door. These dungeons are not what they seem. Big Boss gonna kill me. I'm supposed to let them all out. Now I've chased this weird creature that stole my stuffs. Ah, Big Boss gonna be so upset with me. Oh, look at the diagram. So, key, 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 key equals big door open. Oh! Okay, so if I press B when my thing's completely full... Which is now, I guess, I get a, a ride away. But I, I want to come continue searching the... Okay, whatever. Thank you, Rag. Okay, let's go to town. Oh, shows all, like, all the things that you've killed. I like that. Tell you what, thing, man. I just got back from work. I cannot wait to lay down and take a nap. Oh my god, naps just make the world go round. Ah, the young proprietor of Moonlighter has returned. You look intact. Finally, learn to use that pendant properly. It's all about time, boy. What are you holding? Is that a chart of the dungeons? Where did you get this? You you found old Pete? Dead. I see. Is This is what happened when you chase what's behind that door. Leave it, Will. Just get the artifacts you need from the golden dungeon. I look after Moonlighter. Now, I noticed some posts on the town board that may interest you. Some shops want to move in. That's said to revitalize this town. Apparently, it needs some startup capital first. Would be nice to see some new life in Rhinoka. Nice indeed.
I had a cough, so I just stopped the recording and restarted it real fast. I think I may not be as prosperous as it used to be, but many still visit to pick up a souvenir for the Golem Dungeon. Possibly even one from the closed dungeon if we were lucky. Let's check out this board. Investments. Town? Vulcan's Forge. The Wooden Hat. <clears throat> Do you feel the dungeon too hard? Tired of your old weapon? I can solve that if you bring me enough money and materials. A forge to be reckoned with. Is Brute Force getting you nowhere in the dungeons? Visit the Wooden Hat to find potions and enchantments for this. And then lay retailer, hawker, and banker. Oh my god. 70,000? Try to look for dungeons and the items in the dungeons. Do that dodge to others and come to Lay Retailer, where you'll find the finest items in Rhinoka. Lay Retailer, because life's complicated enough. That was a town hit. Let's go to our shop. <clears throat> oh, I can expand my shop. Oh. Cheap sale box. I'm sold in this sale box. We'll have a 75 cent discount. This useful cash register will entice customers to add an extra 10% tip when paying. Ooh, 40% tip when paying. Ooh, gotta earn that money. Comfy bed. A comfortable new bed will grant adventurous extra health in the morning. <clears throat> extra space for your items. Ooh. I kind of want to get the forge guy. I don't have enough money, though. So I have to sell things at my shop. Do I get to keep this? What is this anyway? Crystallized energy. Let's grab. Take that over there. And then that's a vine. That's a root. That's a golem core. Ooh. Right trigger. Let's see. Golem core. <coughs> I don't know why. I'm, I'm having a... I'm having like a cough back here. We found ways to harness that are unable to create. Okay, so let's go. Let's check this out. Let's sell the golem core. Let's see what happens when I put it at 50. <clears throat> it's uncommon. Let's go 100. Let's go 100. Let, let, you know, we gotta test it, you know? Fabric rich jelly. I don't think you're ready for this jelly. I don't think you're ready for this jelly. Sorry. Go 50 with those. Whetstone, iron bar, teeth stone, vine, crystallized energy. Put this crystallized energy back here and we'll go for 100. There we go. <clears throat> Can I open a shop now? No. I have to go to sleep. Oh, read. Okay. Chest. Quick move. Right bumper, right bumper, right bumper, right bumper, right bumper. Right bumper. Which of that glowy thing sells for a lot, huh? Oh, I had two chests? Wow, hold to sleep. Okay. I have two chests. <clears throat> January 3rd, 10 days from my birthday. Put on your sandals, man. My, my birthday is January 13th. Let's open up the let's open up the store here, see if anyone buys anything. Oh. Uh -huh. uh -huh. Guys, no, no, that's the window. No, 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 no. Go over here. This this is where you want to go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, look. Items. Yay, items. No, no, that's my stove. Thank you. Gosh. Oh, 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 oh. Yay, happy. I got it. I got it. There we go. Don't be look patting your thing at me. Happy. I, don't know, I didn't see what the grandma said. Did the grandma say that the price was too high in that one? What did Grandma say? Grandma, what'd you say? Alright, Grandma, we're, we're running a special. They're $30 now. Special, special! Okay, this person's gonna go talk to it. See what happens. 
Ouch. Okay. Don't put me in the poorhouse. We'll have it. We'll have it. There. Have it. Someone buy my jelly. 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 Oh my god. They don't like the 15? You know what? Maybe. Maybe shop's closed for today because I can't please y'all. I made a couple bucks though. Golden Corner 100, total 100. There we go. See? We made a couple eggs. We gotta go to. Check out the dungeons again, right? I think this game could probably have done a lot more with like the open air and having like a wide map and everything like that, but it didn't be just a normal adventure Zelda love game. So I like what they did different, you know? Oh. Ooh, oh, don't, don't fall off. I got another part. I got another part. Oh, oh no. Ow. Ow, ow, ow. I'm just like swinging for the wide berth there. Alright, get out of there. I was gonna say, can I even harm this guy? No, right? Oh no, oh no, oh, get me out, get me out. Oh, I got two health because of this little thing. Oh, I thought this was lava. I swear I thought that was lava. I was like sitting there, I'm like, oh god, I don't want me standing on lava. Gold ruins. I have two health. Uh, maybe I have to go back? Maybe I... Yeah, let's go back. I don't want to lose everything. The problem was I killed those little things, and those little things just did not like me. I mean, obviously they didn't like me. I'm trying to invade. Oh, look, it's daytime. Hi, daytime. Wait, why don't I have 100 gold? Wait. Why do I have, why, why do I only, oh no, why do I only have a hundred gold? Did I deposit my gold? Dependent laws merchants to return from dungeons in exchange for gold. Oh, I exchanged a, oh my God, really? A hundred gold? A 200 gold? Wow, okay. Let's see. I think the people are gonna buy a teeth stone. Let's, no, teeth stone sounds like more like a thing. Sounds more like a material. Iron bar. Can you, can I get get ten bucks for iron bar? Okay. Hopefully, we sell all that crystallized and those gold. Because I really want to buy the blacksmith. Come on, Grandma. Oh, I forgot I had the potions. I could have right triggered for the potions. I totally forgot the trigger. Did you just come in to use my stove? Everyone just like my window? What's wrong? What's good with my window? Don't you guys have windows at your house? If not, I can cut one. Yay! Buy it. Oh, that's $300. Grandma! Retirement fund? Oh. Sorry, Grandma. I thought you were done already. Sorry.
Um, I feel like I should probably throw someone else down. Oh! Oh, I, I guess I sold for a good price. The good thing is now I can go talk to that big bulletin board and I could bring people in now. Town. See, I can bring people in now. Let's go with the, that guy. Yes. Oh, yeah, look at the smithy already piped up. He's ready to say hi. Let's go say hi. Hi, dude. Hi, you must be Will, no? The one who requested my forge? My name is Andre, Forge Master Extraordinaire. If it's weapons or armor you seek, Vulcan's Forge is the place. Okay, let's see what I got. I got one of three, two of two. That's a Vulcan. What is this? Armor? Yes, yeah, armor. They up my. They actually up my walking speed. Interesting. A fabric bandana, but an iron helmet. Swords and shields. Ooh, I can actually get upgrade on that sword, soldier short shield. I haven't found any of the other materials though. Look how much you can vampire. Ooh. Oh, this is the two-handed sword. Oh, this is the big, the basic. Oh, I wanted the big swords here's a spear here's gloves here's bow i like that you can use different weapons like you could have different weapons ready to go i like that a lot actually let me craft something better Gail. what about you have an exclamation over your head i'd like to know holy crap did you see all the stuff hmm He still has the exclamation over his head. I guess just maybe for fun, maybe just live really likes exclamations. Maybe that's his favorite. His favorite, uh, like you know how some people love periods, some people love question marks. Maybe he's an exclamation type of guy. I think we go to dungeon because those gold runes sold. For a butt load. And I need a little more gold. And I need a little more materials to improve my stuff. Go back to the dungeon real fast one more time. And then I'm probably going to end the video there. But I will continue the stream. Uh, at the... I'll continue the stream probably tonight or tomorrow of this game. By the way, guys, if you're not checking out, definitely look under the, the video. You would have all my links for social media. You're able to follow me on Twitter, Twitch... Which is gonna be Oh oh no oh no oh no Oh get off me get off me get off me oh no Ah get off get off get off get off get off Oh my gosh Okay Ooh Ooh that potion Yeah my Twitch is twitch dot or twitch.tv slash helios so Definitely come check us out live. Okay, so don't put anything there. Don't put anything there. Gotcha. And destroy an artifact in its way. Heard. It's a doggy dog world in the artifact world. Why, this, why can't I roll through that pot? Oh my gosh, did they just... Oh, they hit... I hit them for 50. Woo! That was close. Okay, what's this? What? Oh, it's a pea shooter! A little... He's gonna swing at me. Oh, he missed, though. A little jungle world. Okay. 
with some very trippy that dude there are definitely on shrooms in this world oh i didn't see you where are you going no what Oh, I win. Oh, I'm making a lot of materials. Look at all the stuff I'm getting right now. I could definitely get rolling if I wanted to, but I'm not going to. I'm going to hold on for a second. I got, I still got three potions. Oh, no. Oh, I almost fell down the hole. Oh, that was so close. There's a dungeon. I only explored one way. I can probably explore the other two ways, too. What's this? Freed. Why? Why do our tools keep disappearing? Chamber is full of precious stone and left untouched, but rooms and chests holding our most basic tools keep vanishing. Oh, probably me. Sorry. That's probably a loving. Sp oh, oh, are you? Oh, you're a golem warrior. Ow. Woo! Barely got that one. Whoop! Whoop! <laughs> so much stuff. Oh, I gotta move this though. I don't want that destroyed. Oh, they don't stack automatically? Things don't stack? Oh, interesting. Ooh, what's that? Why is that glowing? Why is that glowing? Did we just unlock something? The doors are closed. Read. This is one of the strange devices that creatures dropped when you fled. It's one's rich actually, almost quite literally rich. For every item you place into this device, gold of some perceived value drops out. It's great if you need to use your pendant in a pinch. The device looks like a mirror, so I'm just going to call it a mirror. Keep it simple. I do wonder, where did the treasure drop inside go, and am I getting the best deal here? Oh. Okay. Interesting. It's 300 gold. 300 gold to uh, use that. Merchant mirror. Into a small amount of gold. Okay, let's see what happens. To I put this here. It gave me 30 gold when they sell for 100. Light essence, life fluid, plant flesh. I don't think I could use my pennant without paying the price, right? The 300 gold? Or is that just like going to steal all my gold? Is that what it's going to do? Is it just going to steal all my gold afterwards? What are you doing? I wonder. That's actually a question I would love answered. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, oh, I thought I, I thought I pulled this amazing move for a second. I was like, watch this. I'm not going to get hit by these things. Okay, let's test this theory right now. Oh, it it's okay. It eats materials until I can pay it. Interesting. And kind of cheap, honestly. <laughs> kind of cheap that I hate. I hate that. I absolutely hate that that that, that happened. Ooh, this has the exclamation mark. Why? Shop, drop, and roll. Oh, look at these expansions, though. Look at the, all these expansions you can do. There must be some crazy stuff that you'll be able to do in this game. 
What did it steal from me? Hardened steel, fabric, golem core. Yeah, but tomorrow I'm going to go ahead and go in and I'm going to go ahead and pop in all this stuff into hopefully the blacksmith. And the blacksmith is going to be able to pull me out this amazing weapon that is going to glow and shine. And he's going to, he's going to shine it up a little bit so it sparkles. And then I'd be the finest girl at the ball. All right, folks, thank you so much for coming and joining. Again, this is Moonlighter. If you liked it real fast, give it a give the video a like and get a comment down below. Tell me what you're going to do with your shop. Tell me what you're going to do with this game once you get it. And uh, tell me if you really liked it. I love the comments. I love hearing about the comment section. It is definitely one of my favorite things to go through and read. So definitely check that out, and I will see you in the next one. Thanks, folks.